Taylor Fritz versus Casper Ruud. It's the second match of the group stage for these guys. And both guys had upsets in their first round matches. Fritz started the year off as the number 23 player in the world. And after capturing the biggest title of his life in Indian Wells, rocketed into the top 10 before settling at number nine in the world to get into the finals. His regular season record was 43 wins, 19 losses, winning three titles from the three finals that he's played, including Indian Wells, which is the biggest title of his career. He also won in Eastbourne and in Tokyo a few months ago. His best win was against Rafa Nadal, the number four in the world at the time, at Indian Wells in that final. So Indian Wells, a massive moment there for Fritz in his career. And his worst loss was actually at the US Open, losing to a qualifier, ranked 303 in the world, fellow American Holt. So a big upset there for Fritz from what has been a phenomenal season. Casper Ruud started the season off at number eight in the world and with two Grand Slam finals, had a chance to be world number one, but ended up peaking at world number two just after the US Open before settling down to number four in the world to get into these finals. Ruud's season record was 48 wins, 20 losses. Again, very active on the tour, which included three titles from six finals, two of those finals being the US Open and the French Open, and the three titles he won, all clay court events in Gestad, Buenos Aires, and Geneva. His best win of the season was against the number four in the world at the time, Zverev, in Miami, a tournament that he ended up making the final of. And his worst loss of the season was against the number 229 in the world, Shelton, in Cincinnati, which was a huge upset. These guys have actually never played before, which is really strange because they're both sort of grown up in the same generation. Fritz is only a couple of years older than Rude, but they've never crossed paths on the professional tour. If Fritz is going to win this one, he's going to have to be aggressive and serve well, like he did against Rafa. He's gonna have to push Rude around, just like he did against Rafa, and not let Rude get on the baseline and play strong and get everything back. He's gonna have to be patient as well because we know Rude does get everything back. If Rude's gonna win this one, he needs to serve well and really drag out these rallies. The longer the rally goes, the better it's gonna be for Rude. And because we know Fritz does get a little impatient and he might get a little frustrated as well, so Rude is gonna have to drag these rallies out as long as possible. This is going to be a very fun matchup. We've never seen these guys play before, and they're both coming off very impressive first match wins against two guys that I guess we all expected to win in their first matches. But I'm going to go with Rude to win this one because I think Rude maybe is a little bit underestimated this tournament. He did make the semifinals here last year, and I think Fritz coming off that Rafa win is going to have a bit of a letdown. I think Rude's going to win this one in three sets, but let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this match?